welcome back to the next video in this video i will make sure i will show you how to apply the liquid glass effect to a ui kit button in native ios application so yeah let's get started so here you can see this is one of the output of liquid glass i'm not sure if you can guys can see it but when i click on it if you notice the animation this is by default i have not done anything so let's see how to use it so it's pretty simple i've just created a ui kit application and all you need to do is just create a ui button as usual set the title title color background color corner radius uh, again this is by default uh, here is a click la listener and here is ns layout constraints and here we are have adding our button only thing which you need to do is you just need to add button dot configuration equal to glass that's it this is will this will add liquid glass to your button there is another thing as called prominent glass as well so let me show you guys that output as well so sometimes this kind of prominent glass uh, are very difficult for the user to see because it depends on what kind of uh, you know um, tint or uh, mode a theme mode they are using okay so prominent glass is one the is one of the easiest to see i guess sorry i was wrong i think the glass one was sometimes difficult to see but because if you see the background color is system blue and it works fine for fine for prominent glass right so let me quickly run it again just to be sure i think i might have confused okay anyways i think this looks fine so yeah and you get this animation as well because if you remove this configuration you will not get this animation but in glass even though the background color is blue that is not very well respected because it depends on what i think the custom theme or tint theme the user is using so it's not highly guaranteed that even if you are using a blue color and if you are making the configuration as glass it is not i think this is a teal kind of a color which i'm seeing right now but yeah that's it thank you for watching bye